Hey y'all, it's Hope at Crafty Hope and welcome. I am working on day three of the Ugly Art Club's five minute challenge. You can find it um, on Instagram with hashtag T-U-A-C five men challenge. You can probably also find it on uh, Facebook there um, in the Facebook group, the Ugly Art Club. So the Ugly Art Club is an online group that was founded by Tiffany of Southern Gals Designs, DD Catron, and Kristen Peterson of Altered State Studios. I'll have links to all of them as well as the club and all of that below. And they do this just before they open up enrollment, which they only do four times a year. So this is this challenge comes quarterly to us, and this time they are doing it with prompts. So today's prompt is splatter. So the first thing I wanted to do since I was just working in this little junk journal, I have a link to how I made it, but it's on just some copy paper there. So I wanted to thicken that up a little bit. So I put down a little bit of collage with some my Uhu glue stick and um, I'm futzing with this a little ago. I think most of my videos I speed up. These I'm not since they're only supposed to be five minutes. And you can see I move a lot slower than I feel like I do. <laughs> I feel like I'm rushing when I do these. Um, but anyway, today's was splatter. And y'all, if you've seen my videos, you know I love some splatter. I am in the season of splatter right now. So I figured that will be easy enough. So I get these couple pages of painting papers down. And then I go to get my... Um, some gesso and I dropped it and so this takes a minute because I had to like yeah um, I used up way more time than I needed to just because I'm clumsy so I'm going to squirt out a little bit of the gesso here and just move it around with my finger who's got time for a paintbrush for real I did pull out a couple of things on to my desk and all that before I got started just so I'd be a little more prepared. Um, one of them was those collage papers. <laughs> Apparently it wasn't gesso, but I did pull out some paint and I pulled out this um, Americana Sea Aqua paint. Now this, this particular paint that I have is old y'all it is thick you're gonna see here in a second as i open it when i put it on that little sheet of paper that's sitting there that it is super thick so i'm trying to use it up i keep it stored upside down so i can get the paint out of it but do you see that doesn't that paint doesn't move so i get it on that little sheet of paper there and i'm gonna just dip my finger in it I, y'all, I really feel like when I'm doing this, I'm moving super fast, but watching this in real time is super slow. Maybe I should speed these up. What do y'all think? Do y'all like seeing them in real time? Or would you prefer if I slowed the, I mean, sped these up a little bit? All right, so I'm just making some finger dots with that sea aqua. Uh, it felt good. I thought, I kept thinking I needed some pink splatter on here later, but I knew that was going to take more time because I didn't pull anything pink. Why would I do that? Now I'm going to just circle each of these um, around, through the wet gesso and everything. This is my Stabilo All Pencil in Graphite. And I'm just adding a little texture basically on there. And I'm like, okay, it is time for my splatter. So I grabbed my handy dandy yogurt cup that's got dried up instant coffee in it. Reconstituted that with a couple spritzes of water. And then I grabbed a paintbrush, wet it real quick, and now I'm going to splatter. I'm also going to paint a little bit in those two corners where there's not anything, just to give them a, a little more grunge and color of their own, I suppose. So I'm going to get that, and I'm going to go ahead and stop my timer. Um, I'm actually going to pause it this time and not just exit out like I did yesterday. <laughs> um, if you missed that, I'll put a link up here in the upper right to yesterday's video. So I dried that real quick and then I'm restarting that timer with my minute and four seconds. And I had pulled, one of the things I pulled out were these stickers. They're just big gold stars. So I'm going to pull one of those out. Y'all, it takes me forever to get the sticker up. It was, it was a trial today. So this this little page today is super simple because I had, you know, I had some issues and I tried not to go over today except for stopping the timer to, um, to dry things. So, all right. So I'm going to stick that little star down. I had also pulled out my Tim Holtz metallic stickers. And when I pulled those out, I happened to see where it said shine brightly. And since I had the stars, I thought perfect. 
Um, so I'm going to put that down, but then decide I need a little more gold on here. And I just happen to have my Liquitex gold acrylic ink on my desk from a project I was working on yesterday. So I'm going to open that real quick. Um, I'm rushing now because <laughs> I was like, oh no, that timer. I think it does go off while I'm splattering here. So I'm going to splatter this gold down on here. I think, yep, there's my timer going off. So I'll finish my gold splatter. And I'm going to dry it and then show it off to y'all. Um, this is a really fun challenge. I hope you will play along with it. Let me know if you are and where you're sharing your five minute creations. Make sure, like I said, check out that hashtag and see what everybody else is making. All right, y'all. I thank y'all so much for coming by and taking time to watch. And hopefully I will see y'all tomorrow. Thank you, y'all. Bye. Mm -hmm.